guys and welcome to the JJ Show. JJ here with another great magic trick to teach you today. Have you ever wanted to read someone's mind? Well, today I'm gonna to teach you how to read minds. Now, this is not your normal magic trick. It takes a little bit of practice, but listen, enough of my talking. Let's get on with Prediction Card. Okay, to read minds is very, very simple. What we have here is a prediction or a guess. We're gonna leave that just there. We're not gonna to touch that until the very end of the magic trick. What we have here is a pack of cards. All these cards are completely and totally different, not one card the same. Now, you could pick any card you like. Let's say you pick the bottom card, which was the uh, King of Clubs. Now, you're not gonna pick the King of Clubs, we're gonna leave the King of Clubs just there. Now, I'm gonna go through the cards. Whenever you like, I like to say stop for me, whenever you like. So say stop. Stop, just there, okay. This is your card. Remember that card for me, okay? We're gonna take this card, we're gonna place that card back in the pack. We're gonna give them a quick mix up, like so. There we go. Now, I'm gonna try and find your card. Uh, okay, I think your card was a black card. Am I right? A black card, a black card, a black. It wasn't a black card. Was it a red card? It's got a red back, you see. Your card wasn't a ten of clubs. No, it wasn't ten of clubs. Okay. <laughs> okay, we'll try again. We'll try again. The next card. Let's try this one here. Was it the eight of spades? Definitely a red card. Okay. Um, I'm struggling a bit today with this one. Let me have a think. I know. Right. I'll tell you what. We'll go over to my prediction. I made a prediction earlier. I wrote it down this piece of paper here. I sealed it with paper clips. I've not touched it since the beginning of the magic trick. Let's have a look and see exactly what that prediction is. There we go, three paper clips removed. We'll open it once, we'll open it twice, we'll open it three times and four times and hopefully it'll reveal your card, the five of hearts. Okay guys, how to do the mind reading card. It's very, very simple. What you need first is an A4 piece of paper now, you're gonna write on that A4 piece of paper any card you so wish. So I've done the five of hearts, which is nice and simple. Once you've done that, you fold it once, you fold it twice, you fold it three times and four times. Once it's folded that much, you can't see through the paper and I put a question mark on it just there. Now, we're gonna take a paper clip, you place one there like that. You're gonna take another paper clip, you're gonna place that one there just like that. And finally, your third and final paper clip will go just there like so. We leave that to one side, we don't touch that anymore throughout the magic trick. Now, I know what you're asking, how do we know what card they pick? It's very, very simple. What we do is we find the five of hearts or whichever card you've chosen. Let's have a quick look where he is. Uh, five of hearts is just about, we've gone past him. Five of hearts, ah, he's just there, brilliant. Okay, we're gonna take the five of hearts and place it on the bottom of the pack. Now, to make sure at the start that no one sees the five of hearts, I just take the top card and place it on the front. Now, this allows me to take the cards and spread them out. So you see all the different cards and the top card or the bottom card is not their card. Now, we take this card here, we turn the pack over and we say, right, okay, you could pick any card at all. So I go to the bottom and I remove the eight of spades. At the bottom of the pack now, we have the five of hearts. Now, to make them pick the five of hearts, is a little bit of practice. What you do is you hold the pack like this and you take away a certain amount of cards from the top, a certain amount of cards from the top until you get them to say stop. When they say stop, all you do is show them the bottom card, which is the five of hearts. You have them remember that card. You put the cards back together like so and you say, right, okay. I would like you to think of your card now. I'm gonna try and find your card in this pack. You go through the pack and you find a black card because you know it's a red card. And you say, was your card a black card? They say no. You say, are you sure? They'll say yes. They say it wasn't the eight of spades. They go, no, you go, right, okay. You can do this wrong twice. Pick another one, put it down. You know it's not that card. Nine of spades, no, okay. Well, that just so means we have this prediction sat here the whole time. Let's have a look and see what that prediction is. You remove one paper clip, you remove two paper clips, remove three paper clips, you open up the piece of paper and you say to them, was your card none other than the five of hearts? Well guys, that does bring us to the end of our mind reading card. I hope you got on really well with it. 
a little bit of practice and you'll really amaze everyone how you can read their minds. We've got a few more videos for you to check out. We've got more videos coming up tomorrow. Now listen, if you haven't done so already, please hit that subscribe button and give us a like. I'll see you tomorrow.